Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to Crystalline's Crystal Clear Visions, where I use my vision, tarot, oracle, music, movies, dreams, Reiki, whatever, to help us get messages from the Most High, from the angels, from our ancestors, our guides, okay, to help push us forward, to give us words of encouragement, and I'm going to keep it a book, y'all, sometimes they just be letting us be nosy, okay, so we give thanks to them for assisting us at this time, I messed up, wait a minute, so thank you guys so much for your likes, your shares, your subscriptions to the channel. Thank you to all of those who book your readings. Um, I appreciate each and every last one of you guys for everything that you do, okay? When it comes to helping me, all right? Um, <clears throat> If you're new to the channel and you want to know how to get in touch with me, you need the link to my Shopify store, any of those things, just uh, check the link in the description box below. It's going to have everything that you need. I'm trying to get my music right, y'all. <laughs> All right, all right, all right. So let's go ahead and get started, you guys. Thank you again for being here. So <clears throat> my dream, y'all. Last night, I dreamt about my husband, or my husband-to-be, right? Um, <clears throat> I remember waking up with, like, a smile on my face about it because I was just so happy that I finally dreamt of him again, although I've been dreaming of him um, a lot, so I feel as though he's getting close. Um, <laughs> he may even be watching. Hey, boo. <laughs> but, yeah, um, but in the dream... I saw my ring, y'all, it's beautiful. Um, I was sitting by this tree. I always, when I go to the lake, it's this one specific tree that I'm always sitting by. And so I was under that tree and spirit was showing me um, what my husband was going through at that time. Like, it's like he wants to come and bring me this ring, but it's like he's stuck, he's trapped, okay? So, and it made me, when I thought about it this morning, cause I kind of woke up I was happy at first, but then, you know, I kind of got in my feelings because I'm tired of, you know, <laughs> dreaming of him. I want him here. <laughs> um, but, yeah, so I woke up and I thought about another dream that I had. So I said, I'll read y'all this dream because I feel as though it coincides, but I need to find it first. Um, <clears throat> but it coincides with... Um, what was going on in this particular dream because like i said he wanted to come like i could feel him you know and he even at one point did come but it was like every time he got ready to come towards me to come to that tree where i be where i'm at um he gets stuck he gets caught up like someone stops him um from moving forward and so I figured maybe y'all might be going through the same thing. Those of you who resonate with this video. So I may have messages for you. Alright. <laughs> I have to find it, you guys. Give me a second. Give me a second. All right, y'all, I found it. So this dream, I had it September 23rd, 2021. <clears throat> it says, I dreamt about selling my products to a lady to help her to detox her system because I used to sell detox stuff. So then I went to a scene where a little boy was in a bunk bed. He was afraid to get down. <laughs> then the little girl climbed up with him. They were friends. His mom was explaining to me that the little girl was just temporary and that me and him were to be together. Then I ended back up with the girl who bought the detox pills. I was explaining how they worked and the difference in the prices. She hadn't released and I started poking her stomach, telling her it was coming. Then I woke up. So this the dream made me... <laughs> and it's so crazy because the next day I had a dream about the same person but just older. Um, 
It says, my dream was super long. My husband pulled up and told me he had been waiting for me to get my shit together and asked me, was I ready for this? And I told him, yes. And he said, good, and told me we were rich. Um, then this girl I once knew was getting ready to make a move to a new place, so she asked for my help. So I went to where she was in a truck, and she stood outside and... Um, I don't know, watch me. That don't look like watch, but yeah. Then we were inside her place when I played with the baby and we talked about her how unhappy she was. But then the atmosphere switched and I felt I needed to get out, so I left. As I was walking away, I felt her staring at me from the window. Then I ended up at a tra track and I started walking for about an hour. This is my second day because I had walked the track before with the older lady. When I made it to the other side of the track, it turned into a skating rink where the lady from before was telling me another skater directions, but she looked up, but she looked, but she looked at me, hugged me and asked where I had been. And I had told her I already walked on the track and hour so i was only gonna skate the rink twice but i went around so fast i wanted to do another lap then an old friend called and i ended up at walmart with her and the other old friend that i helped move we all went to the walmart and they told me that she was angry with me when i asked about the old friend because i had been acting different and not calling her but my friend stepped in and was like she had been busy that that's no reason to be mad then <clears throat> the other friend was just staring again. Then we ended up in a camper. I was telling him how I was getting married. And and the uh, one friend was like she wouldn't be in an arranged marriage. But my friend and me were laughing because she was jealous. So then I went to grab my phone and it supernaturally flies out my hands. I asked what was that. They tried to laugh it off like I threw it, but I didn't. I didn't care though because I was excited for my next chapter in my life with my rich husband. <laughs> okay, so um, those are the type of dreams that I have. And <clears throat> sometimes they go with the reading, sometimes they don't, okay? But um, yeah, so if you're wondering why your person hasn't come, your soul mate, your husband, um, or wife, whoever is watching this, whoever, however y'all resonate, um, this person could be stuck, okay? This person could be trapped, right? Um, so in my case, this person is dealing with someone else, okay? Um, but I can tell that this person <clears throat> wants to leave because in the dream, in both dreams, the dream I had last night, the dream that I read with the mother telling me that it was just temporary and then the next dream where he actually did come um i could the energy was still the same as if i could feel him wanting to be close to me but somehow feeling like he couldn't leave like he was afraid okay so and that's crazy because in the dream that i had last night i was at the lake at the tree and where he was was away from me but in like a, I don't, it wasn't really an apartment. I guess it was the apartment building, but he was like on the top floor, which is crazy because in that dream that I had back in September of last year, he was in a bunk bed. So it was like, well, there's a distance between us, okay? And again, he was wanting to come forward, but not able to because of whoever this person is that he may be dealing with, okay? That has him stuck. <clears throat> listen we got the nine of swords that popped out first card okay so this is definitely someone who is losing sleep this is someone who's worried okay this is someone who is trying everything that they can in order to um, gain some sort of information here i feel like this is giving me like obsessed energy someone is obsessed with um trying to figure out a way to I don't know heal possibly she has on blue and blue signifies healing to me um this could be someone who 
this is someone who is going through like a little bit of depression here. If you can see, she's very like sad, okay? Trying to figure out how to change the situation here. Um, this person is not really... Like if you see the cats, cats are spiritual animals, okay? They talk about spirituality. So this person is like not really um, interested in their spirituality, although they have their spiritual guides that are trying to help them, okay? With this um, red cardinal here, this could be someone who may have lost someone close to them. Red cardinals usually signify family that has crossed over, okay? But again, I feel like this person is trying to learn about the spiritual world, but the spiritual world is trying to connect to this person here. This is someone who, again, is losing sleep. This is someone who um, is possibly in need of some sort of healing okay this is someone waiting for the sun to come up so we have the wheel of fortune here and the wheel of fortune is about someone's luck changing about their destiny changing destined things coming towards them okay um so someone could definitely be ending out a cycle someone could be worried about how destiny is changing okay so someone could be trying to stop destiny from changing stop it from moving forward um stop what is meant to happen but you can't stop what's meant to happen because that is not in your control here you know we have the hangman here and the hangman talks about someone who has enlightenment here as you can see this is someone who is stuck here okay they have um this lock on their feet that are, that's keeping them stuck to this tree but this is someone who has enlightenment okay the hangman knows particular knowledge if you can see hair signifies um knowledge that people have so this is someone who has like they he has some sort of knowledge but not necessarily um a lot of knowledge like this is someone that is still learning okay learning and looking at things from a different perspective here and as you can see he's tied to a tree remember i said that um in my dream i'm at a tree um so again this is someone again i'm, I'm feeling this though um someone's destiny is definitely changing here okay someone is trying to figure out a way to keep destiny from changing here someone's trying to figure out a way to you know get unstuck from a situation that they are in and then there's someone here who's just kind of like minding their own business just waiting on the wheel to finally turn here so what else is going on spirit listen <laughs> We got this relationship here with this two of cups. So someone definitely wants to um, come towards, <laughs> yep. This person, this person that's stuck in this hangman position, they know that there's someone that they want to go towards here, okay? I'm feeling as though whoever this is with this uh, nine of swords energy um, is someone that is trying to pretend like they are this hangman, this person who's, as you can see, they're in green trying to pretend like it's this hangman soulmate okay the person that they are intended to be with but i feel as though this hangman is getting um they're getting knowledge that this isn't the person that they're really wanting to be with okay they're trying to figure out how to go towards this person possibly yeah because like i said in my dream the the person is trapped like they're trying to figure out how to go on this new journey here with this page of wands they're trying to figure out which direction to go so this person may be new to spirituality as well um or this person may have, you know, started out on a journey to spirituality and they ended up getting stuck. This is giving me like Little Red Riding Hood vibes, okay? So this is someone who set out to take grandma the food, you know, to help her get ready, but got distracted along the way here. And because of that distraction that is why this person is now in this hangman situation because they realize that they need to get out of whatever it is that they're in okay they need to get away from this person that has yep <laughs> that's why little red riding Hood came out so this person is definitely being um bamboozled <laughs> so you remember when when little red riding hood makes it to grandma's house and the wolf is there and he he's dressed in grandma's clothes and she's like you know something about you looks different grandma what big eyes you have and grandma's like the better to see you with my dear 
what big teeth you have and that's when he i'm feeling as though this masculine energy is is realizing that it's really time to get away from this energy that they have been tricked by because um there is danger looming okay they're realizing that this is a dangerous situation that they're in um and this is not what they are supposed to be in yeah we have the lovers here so this definitely this masculine energy is ready to go towards their soulmate the person that they're meant to be with here you got the lovers with the two of cups um so this person is ready to take this new journey here um they're ready to learn um about all of the 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 spirituality as well i feel as though like this masculine is with this with the hangman that is someone who looks at things from a different perspective so i see that this masculine may be feeling like getting into spirituality may still be learning about it. it's very new to this person but there are things that are happening to this person that they can't explain okay they're they're not able to talk to others about here um but like i said i feel as though this masculine energy may have came up on an energy that um caused them to be stuck okay caused them to kind of veer off in the wrong way here okay with this page of wands here they took um they took the scenic route right the long way <laughs> um in order to get to this um situation well, i never even noticed that this person looked like they got locked <laughs> okay but in locks when hair signifies strength signifies knowledge so someone definitely is starting to get those downloads through their hair like they're starting to get that spiritual communication and that is what is letting them know that they are in danger yeah we got the ten of swords here that someone is trying to sabotage this person for a source keep this person stuck and locked up like i said we have and to, so that they won't be able to celebrate here with this four of wands they won't be able to come together celebrate have this union get this new stability this new home here so i feel like this masculine energy is now just now starting to understand um how they were sabotaged here with this ten of swords how someone was trying to keep them stuck here and i also feel as though or how someone else may have been sabotaged as well because this nine of swords could also be um the energy that this masculine wants to go towards okay and this person is like learning all this knowledge um learning about spirituality connecting with those that are around them um waiting on this person to come towards them but i see this masculine energy um is realizing that someone tried to betray this energy yeah try to betray stab this person yeah that's why i'm getting this strong little red riding hood vibes okay someone definitely um bamboozled somebody in this situation they they pretended to be this masculine's um person soulmate um in order to try and take this person out here and i also feel now that this energy is also in regret for trying to keep this person stuck okay keep from trying to keep this wheel of fortune from turning okay they were trying to stop someone's destiny here yep we got the six of pentacles here so definitely someone wants some sort of equal balance relationship here where you know they know how to balance between the new and the old here um someone who wants to who knows how to give equally receive equally okay this is someone who has their heart chakra very open here so again i feel as though this masculine energy is now seeing the truth of the matter they're seeing um how they their counterpart has been sabotaged listen remember i said in my dream i was underneath the tree here okay so this person um 
may have tried to come and also pretend to be this masculine energy in order to sabotage so this could also be a warning to the feminine energy that you know of course there's someone that is trying to sabotage you to keep you from getting to this destiny but also be careful of the people that may be trying to come towards you okay um because this person here you know stabbed you in the back and is running off here okay so this person is possibly getting gifted and being able to shape shift, being able to turn into someone else to disguise themselves as someone else in order to try and change destiny here. But I don't feel as though this is something that is going to work, but it is something that has been possibly going on for lifetimes, okay? Someone trying to sabotage these two people, these lovers from coming together, okay? From having this love here. So we do have a king of wands here coming out. So this person could be uh, Aries, Leo, Sag, doesn't have to be. Um, but this is someone who gets very prepared this is someone who is making plans to go into some sort of battle here this is someone who may be wanting to communicate here passionately to someone um we'll see why that king of swords popped out or king of wands i'm sorry and then we have the two of wands here so this is definitely someone ready to leave the past and move forward here okay this is someone who is trying to figure out how to get away so this person may be in their king of wands energy trying to make a play a game plan to move forward here yeah because so i'm getting because there's two people here with the red on right you have um, someone who is kind of younger and mature here with this red on and then you have this king here who is trying to also figure out both of them are looking at a world he has a world map and he has a globe in his hand both of these people are trying to figure out how to change some sort of destiny here um, in order to figure out where to go and if you can see on this ten of swords card someone is definitely um, there's someone here with the red cape on that's running away so I feel as though someone may be trying to, there could be several people trying to cause confusion in order to stop again destiny from changing here. Um, trying to keep someone, trying to confuse someone, to keep someone locked up here um, so that they don't realize yeah, it's a case for both the masculine and the feminine energy, okay? There's a feminine energy who is who is keeping this masculine energy locked up here, trying to control this person's money here, um, trying to keep this person from moving forward here. And there's a masculine energy who is also trying to come in and sabotage the feminine energy as well. Um, and so I'm seeing, you know, very strongly that that is definitely something that both sides need to watch out for. OK, so there's definitely people trying to stop these unions from coming together here. Yeah, we got the high priestess at the bottom of the deck and the high priestess is someone who knows secrets. That's someone who knows um, how to manifest this is someone who knows how to do divinatory work as well. Um, so this could be this this high priest this energy could know that or see all of this stuff going down okay um to me this is giving me confirmation that what i'm seeing is actually what is going on here okay um there's definitely two people two energies trying to keep two more energies from coming together here we do have the four of wands which talks about celebration here so i feel as though these could be um these other energies trying to again manipulate trying to make it to where these these other two energies don't aren't able to come together okay they aren't able to um work together like they are wanting to so it's definitely a lot of people here trying to change destiny, okay? Trying to keep these people from being able to come together. There's people trying to sabotage by backstabbing. They're trying to put people in jail here. Um, just whatever they can do to keep these two people from coming together here.
from realizing their potential. Hi, Spirit. What else do we need to know? Twenty-four thirty-three on the clock. Anything else? Any other messages? Yeah, we got the Ten of Cups here. So someone is definitely trying to figure out how to get this, this happiness, okay? What they can do to break away from out of this prison here to keep this um, other energy from sabotaging this other person here, um, this feminine energy here. So they're trying to definitely learn different ways to get past this situation here um because this person does want to get their ultimate happiness their wish fulfillment this is someone who definitely wants to have um a family here but they're trying to get past all of these challenges this is someone who is finally seeing all the challenges that have been placed in front of them and so they're trying to again put together some sort of um, plan to overcome this situation here okay this is someone that's ready to outsmart that wolf right yep we got the four of swords here so the four of swords talks about um well with this eye here someone is definitely definitely watching paying attention to their surroundings here um this is someone who is going through some sort of transformation here um the four of swords talks about um Someone could be passing away here. So that could be a way that someone is able to get out of these obstacles. Um, the Four Swords also talks about resting here. So someone may be needing to get some rest as well. Um, possibly they may be, this could be someone who could be getting signs through their dreams on how to overcome whatever this situation is. Um, but this is definitely someone that is taking their time to get the truth here this is someone who is learning how to clear their mind here um possibly doing a lot of meditation here but definitely someone who is is trying to figure out how to get past all of these illusions here um this is someone who may have had a lot of options in the past here but they're ready to close out that cycle here um with the 21 breaking down to the world so this is definitely someone who is start ready to start something new this is someone who wants a new home this is someone who may be needing to move here or may be moving here in order to get away from um this cycle that they have been trapped in okay so this is definitely someone coming to the end of um this journey right we do have this hangman here so this is someone who is looking at things from a different perspective with this king of wands that's someone who is getting prepared okay so I, I definitely feel like this masculine energy is getting prepared to move away they're getting prepared to get out of this situation this is someone who is trying to figure out how to possibly get out of some sort of legal situation that they could be going through um this could be someone who may have been i'm feeling though someone tried to set somebody up as well to try and make it look as though they stab somebody in the back um but i feel like that is now starting to backfire on them okay the truth is really starting to come out um and and so again this masculine energy is 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 possibly the one who is putting together all the facts so that the truth does come out the way it's supposed to come out so they no longer have to go through this situation here okay this has been a long journey for this masculine energy yep ace of swords that spirit saying that this is the truth here this is this masculine is getting ready to close out whatever this situation is they're realizing you know the people that were around them that they trusted were actually um setting them up sabotaging them trying to keep them put in jail in order to keep them from moving forward in order to keep them from fulfilling their destiny here we got the eight of pentacles here these people were working very hard um yes yeah, somebody may have passed away they may have caused someone to pass away and they're trying to blame this on this masculine energy here and again he is trying to figure out how to get out of whatever this situation is okay um like i said i feel as though this masculine is starting to or needing to um do some heavy meditation here this could be someone who needs to rest here needs to make sure that they're getting plenty of sleep here this could be someone who um may be focusing right now on work here um yeah this is somebody who's definitely going through some sort of um 
blockage here possibly within their money they're feeling stuck here but i'm feeling as though spirit what what can they do to get unstuck when it comes to this money situation yeah they're waiting with this three of wands it is someone waiting on something to pop off for them okay so um i'm just getting they may need to wait just a little bit longer the answer is going to start coming to them okay the change is definitely going to come for this person and it won't be long here yes what this person is about to receive some sort of key here um with this four of wands some sort of key to help them get out and celebrate okay this is someone who is going to start taking control of their life card number four is the emperor so i've seen the empress i just didn't point it out and the emperor here so this is definitely um a twin flame situation something that was destined to be together so someone is about to receive some sort of key to unlock them okay to keep them unstuck um to help them go on this new journey towards this um soulmate that they are supposed to be working with okay um so this should either be confirmation in this video that you whatever you dreamed about that's confirmation that that's what spirit is wanting you to do in order to get out of this situation here or you could be about to receive this dream so make sure that you are taking the proper precautions to um, make sure that the spiritual world is able to get through to you yeah we have the nine of wands so the nine of wands is the wounded warrior um card number 26 breaking down to eight so that's destiny um they're at this park which talks about new love so someone is definitely destined to to, um get this new love that they're wanting to go towards okay but again it's going to take a lot of following your intuition and we're ending it off with the two of cups here and the two of cups again is a we have the two of cups here twice so this is a masculine energy that's ready to go towards their destiny they're ready to enter into this equal relationship um it's something they've been thinking about it's been on their mind for quite some time here and again they're about to start move movement forward okay so again if you are wondering what is the hold up in this situation this masculine is just now coming to terms with the fact that they know who they want to be with who they're supposed to be with and they're coming up with the master plan to um get past that okay i'm thinking of a master plan <laughs> <laughs> all right so you guys i'm going to end that there i hope that this message was enlightening to someone there please make sure y'all hit that like button share subscribe to the channel hit that notification bell so you know when i upload videos and until the next video i love you guys so much bye